theory of climate change explains that carbon dioxide put into the air by humans causes global temperatures to rise. A recent 2016 Yale Opinion Estimate said that 35% of Americans disagree with this and say that global temperature rise is caused by natural changes. Another 30% believe the issue is widely debated among scientists. And finally, another 27% said they distrust those experts. We're going to explore why people hold those beliefs, and we're going to start with the mind. Humans are psychologically motivated to pay attention to ideas and information that elicit a positive reaction in the brain. This is a phenomenon called assimilation bias. So let's say, for example, a denier sees this statement made in an article. While supporters pay attention to the 97% that agree, deniers are likely to point out the 3% that disagree. They assimilate the information according to their bias. This carries us to the public misinterpretation of scientific uncertainty. Say, for example, a skeptic reads that not all storms are caused by climate change, or that the intensely active hurricane season was likely caused by climate change. They might misinterpret this uncertainty, saying it's just likely to mean that the theory is no good. But science is about giving the best explanation for a phenomena. It's not about always getting the right answer. Well-known figures also contribute to public misconceptions on climate change. Take, for example, when President Donald Trump calls climate change a hoax created by the Chinese. So Obama's talking about all of this with the global warming and that, and a lot of it's a hoax. It's a hoax. I mean, it's a money-making industry, okay? It's a hoax. In the meantime, China is eating our lunch because they don't, they don't partake in all of the rules and regulations that we do. When skeptics see people in power make direct statements on important topics, they listen, simply because of that person's place in society. This goes for climate change activists as well, like Leonardo DiCaprio, who blamed temperature rise caused by climate change for having to move locations when filming The Revenant. Making The Revenant was about man's relationship to the natural world, a world that we collectively felt in 2015 as the hottest year in recorded history. Our production needed to move to the southern tip of this planet just to be able to find snow. Climate change is real. It is happening right now. Critics and locals were quick to point out that the cause was not climate change, but rather a natural cycle that has occurred in that area for hundreds of years. Media also plays a role in the public misperceptions of climate change. Major networks like Fox News and CNN fail to properly inform their audiences. They highlight the drama rather than open the discussion for serious debate. No matter what side of the argument you're on, we should agree to come together to fight the barriers that restrict us to be able to properly talk about scientific issues. This has been Case and Hunter reporting for the Daily Texan. Thank you for watching.